Welcome back. 55 years can take its toll on just about anything, especially a 605 foot tall icon. But this landmark is ready for its makeover. The plans are in place. The platform has been raised. Time to get to work. It looks like a giant billboard in the sky, but this massive tarp installed beneath the needle's top house provides workers a refuge from our notorious Northwest weather. Behind the enclosure, nearly everything has been stripped away. This area was once the restaurant. All this is necessary to install the material that will change the way visitors see the needle. We went back you know, in history, we went back to original designs, original models, and we found that they actually wanted all this glass. Time and technology didn't allow for as much glass to be installed as was originally designed. For the new look, Hoffman Construction hired Seattle's Herzog Glass to take on the job. And then their contract it was to install pretty much all the glass in this building, even the mirrors in the restrooms. The most talked about install Herzog is doing is to the floor that once held the restaurant. The glass floor didn't come out as an idea initially. We were testing a lot of crazy ideas just for the exercise of experimentation and, and pushing the thinking. Their thinking led to replacing the needle's metal floor with one made of glass. The floor is actually made of two different sections of glass. The top layer has six sheets laminated together. The bottom piece, four layers, and sits just below where the metal soffits once stood. There's little dots that are on the glass, so you can't see in, but you can see out. Between the panels, there are 12 new motors capable of rotating the room once around in as little as 20 minutes. When you are able to see through the glass, you will see those real assemblies and you will see the motors that are there and the gear. Best of all, you get to see previously hidden views of the needle itself. And one thing that we're doing that hasn't happened in the past is we are highlighting the actual design and engineering of the Space Needle in ways that have never been exposed before. But if you prefer to look through glass rather than walk on it, the glass on the observation deck is a clear alternative. It's a composite of three pieces of glass and each piece of glass has an inner layer so they're sandwiched together. It's laminated glass and in the laminations there let's say if you shattered the glass it would shatter the glass but the glass would all retain itself as one piece and so that creates the safety where it's not going to come down. With the elevators being too small to carry the panels, each had to be hoisted up by a gantry crane. That is, when the weather would allow it. Mother Nature was our challenge. She wanted to blow and she also the thermals. There are 48 11 by 7 panels in all, each one weighing over a ton. You have so much weight out there and all the crews, they're working and they very much respect that weight as they're flying any of those pieces in. To help install the panels, a special lifting machine was created just for the precarious job of putting the panels in their place. I grew up with my dad being a glazier, and I so I grew up with him doing house residential glass. And so I thought, I thought that's a little bigger than my dad's ever done. It's not just a smooth, we'll just move it like here and set it down and you're done. It's a very deliberate and careful process. It moves and you make very, very small movements with that glass until it finally gets set. It. Machines set the panels in, but human hands secure them. And that's really what it gets down to. It's really about the hands and the crews and the craftsmanship that goes along with installing something like that. Another glass feature is the new benches, or sky risers as they're called. All the glass used in the Century Project has been tested rigorously for strength and stability. All told, 176 tons of it will be used in the renovation. It's sure to give visitors a view unlike any they've ever experienced before. Coming up. To build these in the sky while we're open on this crazy schedule, it's been phenomenal. Cutting away the past to create the future. The Space Needle remaking an icon is back after this.